founders of Iowa series with a visit to the state capitol. This week, photojournalist Roger Riley takes us to Iowa State University, where he found several wonders, but one in particular that Iowa has to offer. The campus of Iowa State University, at its center, the Campanile. No, that's not it. Maybe it's Visha, the annual spring celebration. No, that's not it either. Our wonder is found in this building called the Durham Center. In its lobby is a replica of the first computer ever built. That's right, the first ever electronic computer called the ABC was built at Iowa State University. Adonassoff was aided in this effort by Associate Clifford Berry. The name ABC is Adonassoff Berry Computer. Attention to Adonassoff did not come until a patent lawsuit happened in the 1970s. The judge ruled that a claim by the ENIAC Computers designers in Pennsylvania was not valid. The judge ruled that the first work ever done on a computer was at Iowa State. The judge ruled that ENIAC was derived, that's the word they used, derived from the ABC. So that essentially overturned the patent on the ENIAC. And essentially at this point, there is no patent on the electronic digital computer. The actual first computer was eventually sent to the scrap heap. A couple of original pieces remain next to the replica. But Adonassoff's ideas for innovation are still ongoing here. So we're here in front of the C6. It's the world's highest resolution, fully immersive cave system. So in something light years away from the ABC, this virtual reality cave surrounds viewers. This unit just received a $5 million upgrade. We do a lot of work with virtual prototyping. Manufacturers are uh, focused on reducing the time uh, it takes to produce products and improving the quality of their products. We can help them do that with digital prototypes. So in fact, this is being run by computers that would be equally uh, good for uh, computer gaming. So kids would love to have these computers to play games with. So There's a, a clustered computer in the, the other room that has uh, 96 CPUs and 96 graphics processing units. It's a tremendous supercomputer to drive the C6. The contrast between the C6 and the ABC is striking. You couldn't store music on this and download it to an iPod. You couldn't play video games on this. You can't even really write a letter or a document on it. But the fundamentals are there in terms of storing and manipulating information. With another of the seven wonders of Iowa, it's Iowa State University, the birthplace of the computer. Roger Riley, Channel 13 News. That uh, first ever computer replica is on display in the lobby of the Durham Center at Iowa State. Public showings of the C6's high-end capabilities, the virtual reality stuff, plan to be started up this fall. And make sure you watch next Saturday for the next wonder in the Seven Wonders of Iowa series. Roger takes us to western Iowa to discover a 100-plus-year-old treasure. We'll be right back. Here's